That's kind of dope. That was fun. I had a little bass, bass, bass drum travel. Bob, you're, you're gonna hate me, but I still can't. I can't hear you. I had to take off my headphones. I'm not hearing you in the mix. Good grief. You also, have, you also have to realize I have a wall of symbols, and this is like. I hear Hunter perfect. Um, Do you want, should I turn down? Yeah, maybe we'll turn Hunter down. Um, but it's also like my, it's probably my symbols. I, I play hard, I, I realize that. Um, but I want to hear more. I mean, it's sick. Yeah, it's fun.
song in the last week. Yeah. <laughs> Shout out to Tucker. Okay. All right, well, let's see. I just need practice with that transition. Yeah, so. I just know it's like if you were doing that, it's all it seems like a lot of work to get back into that. Yeah, the one on that course. Yeah, once I figure out, um, it sounds awesome. What I'm doing there, right? I'll, it's I'll just kind of hone in on that course. transition because then I'm like, during the bridge, I'm thinking so hard, I'm like trying to fish for ideas. Yeah, that I miss the the transition, but that time it, it was close. Yeah. Oh, dude, I forgot to tell you. Yeah. I found out in my Yamaha DAD 10 app, there's an audio 
separation and functionality. Oh, nice. So I could take a Feathered Friends song and just strip the drums on the fly. Which is so, so convenient because I want to do some like drum playthroughs. Right. That's cool. Without, you know, having to you go through and do a lot of work.
got two more. Um.
る作業<笑>